God bless you, sir. Ama, Abiola. Abiola. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh Lord, you need to introduce us. We go to the pay. Oh Lord, it's bullets. Oh Lord, I got one. Oh Lord, take care for us. Thank you, thank you. Um, I was to be late. Who in what you know? Oh Lord, take care for you. Oh Lord, oh Lord, you need to. Asha. Oh Lord, take care for us. Oh Lord, I need. Oh Lord, I need to be there for you. Asha. I tell you, oh Lord, I need to be there for you. Asha. I want to tell you, I want to ask you. Kuli jeba ni jefu. Asha. Aba mo katiwa ti pele lomu ashi. Asha. Aba mo aba mo katiwa lomu jefu. Asha. Ola ho lola kwata ila 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 ni kwa nasi. Naka besi. Eh ki briefly introduce. Eh amulo ye wa despite pele lomu jefu eti mo. But eh maashi ni kuli ma kasa kesho mo. So ma ko ni ki eh okuli ni ni amulo ye. So aja ki otumba da amola ko di di. Let's put it off more. Two, three, six, seven. Let's go and grab this, you know. We're about to go there. We're going there. We're going there. Oh yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I want you to say it for that. That's how it is. October, the year that the Amola was born on the 10th of October, 1956. The family of her, I did Amola and Madame Rafia and Mokeda Amola in Ajinova, in the first division of Lagos State. He attended a South Dean Primary School, Epe, and gained a tuition to Epe General School, all in the Epe Division of Lagos State. After secondary education, he worked with Nigeria Ekna Telecommunication Limited, Marina Lagos, now Niger, from 1977 to 1986. He later joined the International Engineering Industrial, Industrial Construction Company, Africa, as communication officer between 1986 and 1992. Otuba Otuba Dayola, Daramola traveled to the United Kingdom of United Kingdom for further study. He is a graduate of law with LLB Horn from the University of East London. He is a member of the Institute of Leadership and Management and Agile Print to certified project manager with years of experience leading projects that have delivered increased revenues and cost efficiencies across complex digital transformation, process improvement, services, CRM, and mobile application. He has the proven ability to evaluate business process, identify opportunities and manage cross-functional team in safe agile and water and a waterfall environment of implement. Kabeshi, I hereby present to you or to back. So the full lap for the Otubadar Amola is our own story at the of famous NT. Amola was born exactly 65 years ago, today, 11th March 2022, at Bangura, Okeido, Abekuta, and today happens to be her birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Her father was Pa Mustafa Oritobu Adufe Adeli, and her mother was Madam Adikat. Yabodi, Ayeke, Adeli, both of blessed memory, all of you came up. I said, well, I don't know, not all of us came up. Thanks to not enough. 
And Jack also attended at South Dean Middle School. And South Dean also was in the same school. But they did Attending at South Dean Primary and South Dean Middle School. You could you could get this seen that we have a child party for them here. We are just seeing our people as well as the wild dream girls who open the club and passed out in 1975. She joined the services of Federal Radio Corporation in 1976 as a studio manager and was later transferred to Radio Lagos in 1977. And she was one of the pioneer staff of Tiwantiwa Station Radio Lagos. Shortly after she left Radio Lagos for the Nigerian Television Authority of Elkuta, and she became the first announcer to be recruited by, by the station. And the Abekuta, the raw station of dedication, new and old experienced staff, brought out the best of Tony, and she became the head of the presentation unit, aside, aside doing other duties incidental to the professional funding, newscasting, and other duties as assigned. At the time she that, she was able to bring out a multi part talent with a cutting edge value which added greater contributions into the broadcasting industry in the state and, and, national, and nationally for almost two decades. She ruled the airways and the, and the social circle as a celebrity before was voluntarily opting out of service in 1990 with a well-earned commendation to show for it. Everybody is the world. Tony relocated to United Kingdom a few years ago in search of higher value, global experience and golden shares, which became another turning point in her life full of determination, giant strides, challenges and successes. But she has she has never for once forgotten her roots in Bangura as she was always responding to any clarion call made to her and in, and in always contributing a quota towards the development of her community. Hannah Nikadesi, she attended the University of East London in, in Tatford to study law and she obtained an LLB in 2017. She still resides in London where she works as an advocate for homeless people in the, in the London borough of Red Bridge alongside her private business. Tony is a community oriented man full of passion and energy and this endeared her to the, to the love of her life, Otumba. Yola, Daramola, and they are blessed with children and grandchildren. Good morning, please. Good morning, please. Good morning, please. Good morning, please. in Bagura land. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know all the what what they call Tongwai. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, he has always been very, very supportive of his royal majesty. Baba Je Ulori for Baba Bura. I can go for Thank you. 